Look at that. Building guys were here today. They literally started this morning and this is what they got done in just today. Insane. Got the doors all ready to go, framed up. Kinda, you know. Wow, that is so cool. Electricians have been here working on things. There's some of the tower parts. They're putting the conveyors together. That's what uh, the big guys have been working on. That is a pit. Oh yeah. This is going to be epic. Look at that, the leg has begun. Everybody was worried about stairs on the grain bin. You got stairs on the leg in the tower and you walk up there, you walk across the trough on top of bins. No stairs needed on the bins. These stairs, nice and wide, good railings. So, they'll be nice. This is awesome, it's finally, this is probably the one thing that you really look forward to, besides the bends, is the leg. It just really changes the dynamic of the project. There you have it. Got it spray foam. It won't be heated or cooled, um, you know, right now. We might heat it maybe sometime down the road, just not this year. That spout just drops right through the roof and those two stands then the other two are on the outside so they don't have to worry about them here's our office the works of it here's the door We're gonna have two nice big glass windows all insulated you might wonder why is there a door up there and a window well you guessed it we're gonna have a second story you remember that staircase we've been working on or not? Yeah, yeah. All right, so we got a name for the upstairs. If you can come up with a better one, please drop it below, but I think this is pretty good. So the downstairs area for right now is going to be called the Sukup Situation Room. And the upstairs loft, we'll probably finish that off this winter. We're going to call that. The Sukup Suite. Yeah. There you go. Later. Originally this office was going to be like 10 feet smaller. 10, 12 feet smaller. So we added on a little more. Honey Badger actually really wanted to take it all the way to the end of the building. But then that kind of took up some space here that we can park vehicles. So we decided, hey, you know, they were just going to drop a, a dog house here. It's like, hey, just make it come off the top of the roof and just finish it out 
and we got plenty of room for a second floor. So we're like, well, that's, that's where we'll make up our space. We got that spiral staircase. It'll be right here in this corner. You'll walk right up and you'll have all that room. And the best part, we even got gonna have windows up there. So you'll be able to sit up there, look out, look into the truck, be kind of cool, be really neat. Couch, uh, sleep up sleep. You know, a microwave, a fridge, just kind of a little hangout. You take a nap on a hot summer day after square baling or round baling some hay. Fix some tile. Or fix some tile. So we're looking at looking forward to it. And there's Bucky. Just buckying it up. Yeah, yeah, Bucky. Not yeah, buddy. Yeah, Bucky. I don't know when I'll do the next update video, but this will be a part of it. Probably won't be the end of it, so by the next one, the leg will probably be up. I have some conveyors up, catwalks. So, stay tuned. Seeing the funnies. Here we are on the leg. It's about as tall as the the bins. I think there's like one or two more sections to go, and then they'll have this baby done. But these stairs are really nice this thing is coming along really good legs are in there you can see so this is why we didn't put ladders on the bins just because we got those legs on the stairs so this is why we didn't put ladders on the bins we got those legs on the stairs No need to spend the extra money for the stairs on the bins when you probably aren't gonna use it much. So that's the idea there. All right, so guys, this is just to go to show. If that Suka stand on the overhead bin was green and then we had the red, it just wouldn't look right. So now you can truly understand, you know, why we did it. It's, it's, it just looks so much better coming down the road it's just great everything matches it's it's crisp it's beautiful and then the souk up the red and white just everything about it it's great top of the leg but I guess this isn't even the top because there's another section 10 feet so not too crazy but I believe the distributor goes right there and, uh, yeah this will be interesting to see how this all works it's pretty cool and you know when you're up here it the bins, like it seems like, oh, it's just right there. I don't know. Yeah. See from the ground, it's like, yeah. Wait. Yeah. It's kind of, it's really deceiving. From the ground, it doesn't look that tall. But then when you're up here, it feels really tall. But man, what a view. Bro, you can see it like clear as day. That is crazy. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's, that's a little dry. I mean, it's, you know, five, six miles. That's about six, five miles probably and you can see, as the crow flies. And you can see past there. We're putting the spiral staircase in the souk up. 
situation room. Putting it through the window. We've got Bob the Builder here helping us. Before we frame the windows in, got to get this in. So much for our fancy red paint job. That's okay. We'll ball it up later. Just twist that puppy right in there. Getting a bird's eye view. Okay, going that way a little bit. Guess that's the rotation. Oh, oh no! There you have it. We'll see what happens in a couple months when we finish that, but we had to get it in here before we did the window. Thanks a lot, Luke. Later.